Welcome to my channel, you beautiful people. Please don't forget to subscribe and remember to hit that notification button so you never miss a video. Okay, so today I'm doing a full body um, circuit um, and I'm gonna use um, the BOSU as my base here for all the movements. And mainly we're gonna use um, um, some dumbbells. For core, we're gonna probably bring in um, the Swiss ball just for about two or three movements for core. Okay, let's have some fun. I'm gonna do a chest press here. So you wanna make sure you're nice and rested on there, so your head is nice and comfortably rested on the BOSU. Uh, part of your upper back is resting on the BOSU as well. Engage your abs, have a nice neutral spine at this position. All right, your knees are bent, your feet are nice and flat into the floor. And then from there, we're gonna bring the weight. So we're doing a chest press. Remember when you're doing chest press movements, you wanna press through the mid chest here. So we're gonna start from there. Okay, so we're gonna rotate this at the top so the palms are facing into the middle. Okay, so let's go. As we bring it up, we're gonna rotate it, okay? Breathing in on the way down, out on the way up. Okay, nice and controlled. Keeping it to the mid chest and making sure we're working through the chest. and do one more oh my god <laughs> okay that's the chest press <laughs> so we're sticking into the same position super setting the chest press with some flies here so pet flies so I want to make sure um, keep the same position as your chest press okay again pressing through the chest Bring it up, that's your starting position, so it's over your mid chest. And then from there, you're just gonna bend your elbow slightly as you go out, really feel that stretch through your chest, and then bring it up to the starting position. Okay, breathing out on your effort. Keep it at mid chest. Make sure working through the chest. Okay. <laughs> so that's that one. <laughs> so our next movement. Again, we're maintaining the same position here yeah, as the chest uh, press and the pec flies. So make sure your head is nice and secure on there and your part of your upper back is on the bolster as well. Okay, so now we're gonna do a tricep um, pu uh, push, so uh, tricep press. Okay, so just pushing upwards, bring it down, pushing upwards, okay? All right, so. We're good to go. Keep the weight together, okay? Keep your um, arms nice and close into the sides, and then from there, just push up, working for your triceps, fully extending at the top.
keep it to the over your chest oh my god my triceps starting to burn fully extending at the top making sure you engage those triceps let's do one more okay so that's your tricep press <laughs> okay so we're gonna superset this one with some dips here so I'm gonna use the bowl of soup for my dips all right arms there just gonna press down pushing through your arms oh my gosh so that's that one <laughs> our next movement is going to be a single arm row yeah just remember as you bring the weight up you're really working through your back here and keep a nice neutral spine so with there the side that i'm using i'm just gonna bring my knee back a bit yeah with this side so nice neutral spine abs engaged we're good to go now So, for our next movement, we're gonna do some lateral raises, yeah? So working the shoulders. Okay, so just sit at the top of your um, BOSU. Make sure arms are nice and engaged, you've got a neutral spine. And then from there, you're just gonna lift through the sides. Slight bend through your elbow, and then make sure you just raise the weight sideways, um, making sure it's coming to the height of your shoulders, okay? So, we're good to go now. Nice neutral spine. Okay, working through your shoulders. Make sure you're breathing out on your effort. Breathing in as you come down. So our next movement is gonna be the bridge, yeah? So you wanna make sure head nicely resting on the bosu, a part of your upper back, yes? And then we're gonna use the dumbbell. Just bring it over your hips. Try and keep your um, heels nice and close into your bum stomach squeezed in and then from there you're just gonna thrust up using your hips yeah so upwards into the top then back down also pushing through your heels as you come up squeeze your glutes at the top Feel all that burn through your glutes. All right, pushing through your heels. 
stomach squeezed in right through chill thrusting up through your hips breathing out on your effort so as you come up breathing in as you go down let's do two more let's do one more we hold it for a bit bring it down okay so that's your bridge so our next movement is going to be some donkey kickbacks here yeah? so just think of how you position yourself when you're using the prone leg curl yeah so you want to make sure your hips the top of the bosu and then you're just resting on your elbows yeah so hips on top of the bosu making sure that we're not going to use our lower back here we're just going to make sure we're going to concentrate and using our glutes yeah so from there 90 degree angle and you want to make sure that as you push upwards you're just working through your glutes so your foot is going to come up into the ceiling Okay, just gonna do the other side. Alright, 90 degree angle what you need. Just push up to the ceiling. Keep it nice and controlled. Okay, let's reset. controlled so easy to use your lower back here just try and keep it nice and controlled every so often I feel like I'm using my lower back try and slow it down so I'm working through my glutes okay let's just do one more okay so that's your donkey kick back from the bossy <laughs> so now we change it up we do some core and we're gonna use um, the Swiss ball, yeah? So we're gonna do some leg raises. Okay, so we're gonna set up. So I will put my arms under my hips, okay? Okay, position my arms in the right place to my hips. And then from there, and then grab hold of the ball, yeah? And then so all I'm doing from there, I'm just gonna make sure my stomach is squeezed in, abs engaged. I'm gonna bring it up to the top, about there, nicely down. I'm like squeezed in. So easy for the ball to fall into your face here. Make sure you really squeeze hold of the ball. Do two more. Do one more. Okay. <sighs> I'm gonna finish off with a Russian twist using the Swiss ball. Yeah. So you want to lean back, arms engaged. Make sure um, you got a nice neutral spine. Yeah. And then from there, you're just gonna into the sides. Yeah. So you can have your feet on the floor or you can elevate your feet, so raise your feet off the floor. So we're gonna start with my feet off the floor and then we're good to go.
feet on the floor. Right, still keeping that nice neutral spine. Leaning back, engaged abs. Okay, so that's that. <laughs> okay, so that was a circuit. Hopefully you give it a go and please let me know how you get on. Um, remember to check out my description box for everything in more detail. And please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Till next time, see you later.